So, Father, you came all this way from Russia to find the Holy Grail? Yes. Technically, like Catholicism, Holy Grail is heretical. But this is no time for dogma. Each must do all he can to save planet. Hello, folks. This is Bill Corwin on Radio Free Earth with the news. In the ongoing Tunguska offensive, EDF troops... Giant metal space snake. Yep. Oh, I see. Good. That's good. An update on the Tunguska Offensive. As previously reported, the EDF front has been pushed back. Ah, you have found a Syrian artifact of might. I theorize that the cloud of nanoparticles contained within can grant powerful new skills. However, the human brain may not be... You inhaled it, didn't you? Yep. Uh, of course you did. people up there. They need our help. We'll have your back, sir. I will pray for you. Since you have the shotgun, can you shoot and I'll pray? As you wish. <laughs> oh, benvenuto! Welcome to our friend! How do you like it? Love the food. Hate the traffic. Traffic? Well, my convoy got blown up. Uh, we're better than before. Your neighbors are noisy. Yes, but the view is wonderful. So, what brings you to Rome? Oh, the usual. Saving the planet. This is also his hobby.
That's what I call raising the roof. Thank you, my friend. Uh, I think we have been fighting every day since the city was invaded. We... Massimo. Massimo! No! He... He is dead. Sorry. I saw him fight. He was a real badass. But how... How can he be dead? He is Massimo Murena. The hero of the Italian resistance. The spirit of Roma. Is that really how his story ends? It does not seem right. <sighs> we never get to retire, do we? What's your name? Paolo. Nope. Your name is Massimo Morena. It is? Yep, that's you. Massimo Morena. Hero of the Italian Resistance. Got it? But... Who died? Some guy called Paolo. Just a brave, ordinary Roman. But Massimo Morena will take revenge, won't he? I... Uh... It's what he would have wanted. Take this, my friend. A gift from Massimo Morena. You were successful, my son. You win some, you lose some. Against Can't tell odds, which one this was. The inevitable can be averted. I sense evil presence. Is your priest still tingling? No. I just see pale corpses and floating objects. Sir, it's an organ hemovore. It's a fucking vampire, Kenny. Suckers! Let's go up here some. Sounds like we're about to have company. Ah, forgive me. I almost made Stairway to Heaven joke. You are forgiven, Father. View. Planet Earth, baby! There's no place like it.
This is Bill Corwin, bringing you Memories of Earth. A few of our listeners left us messages about what they miss from the old days. Here's one now. Bubble baths. There, I said it. I miss bubble baths. And incendiary minigun rounds, obviously. I mean, I didn't appreciate them back then, but I sure would like to have some now. It's how I got my call sign, after all. But if I had to pick, like, right this instant, I'd have to go for bubble baths. Or, or, or a really big knife. All right. Thanks for calling in. Let's hope there's foamy, scented bath water in your future, and the uh, guns and knives and stuff. And now, for a short editorial. Who is Lord Ackerman? He's pretty evil, that much is clear. But who is he, really? Who is he when he goes home and puts down the death ray? I'll tell you what I think he is. He's a bully. If you take away his armies, his ships, his propaganda drones, then he's just... And now, a message from Lord Ackerman. Sons of bitches! I'll fuck mental! I'll fuck your whole army! Come at me, you alien pendejo! You want Mexican? I got Mexican! You want American? I got American! Y'all wanna bite me? Come get your Chile con carne! What he said. Sam, nice to see you in one piece. Yeah, yeah. Never been so glad to see your ugly face, cabron. Hey, where's the rookie? I really wish I had a gun! Catch! Oh, I, I lost my shoe. Nice shot! Crap, one-liner, though. I wasn't trying to do a one-liner. I lost my shoe? Dude, that doesn't even make sense. Should've said surprise. Just as you turned around. That would've been sweet. I, I was just trying to survive. I wasn't- This is triple A, boy. You gotta survive with style. Gee, a good one-liner would've been... Uh, can we do this later? This looks like a combat situation.
you why you don't mess with Rodriguez. That's the last of them, sir. So, Kenny, you should have gone for an odd joke. Always good with Gnar. I see you! I think they're all dead. Hey Kenny, I got a good one for you. Ragnarok. <laughs> that does not work. Better than I lost my shoe. I lost my shoe. Wow, I'm still alive. Hey, Kenny, you come up with a good one-liner yet? Or are you still waiting for the other shoe to drop? Rodriguez, cut him some slack. He's new. He'll learn. Oh, yeah. Okay, time to break out the big guns. What, the minigun? But that's Hellfire's. You know what she's like about people taking her stuff. Nah, she won't mind if I take it. That bad. Be my guest. Hey, Joe! Remember when we killed that way with the Tokyo? Hey, we're sticking over the
friends, is an ex-snake. Technically speaking, it's an ex-basilisk. Shut up, Rodriguez! Did you miss me? You're right on time. Hey, Carter! What's new? Did you know this exact same model of bus was used in the assassination attempt on the Italian Prime Minister's personal ufologist in 2052? Now, most people say it was the Illuminati, but I'm pretty sure it was the CIA. Your tax money at work! Why did I even ask? Ladies and gentlemen, the express bus to anywhere but here is now departing. Want me to drive? I don't trust your driving, Stone. Remember what happened in Oslo? Hey, that nun came out of nowhere. You know what's funny? Today's my birthday. Damn, I didn't get you a present.